Hey everybody, coming to you today with our chest and shoulders workout, chest and shoulders routine. Uh, today we're going to have eight different exercises. We're going to superset four series um, and various uh, rep counts. So please pay attention to what I tell you and what's written in the comments section below. <coughs> Excuse me. We're going to start out warming up our chest and our shoulders with three sets of push-ups to 15 reps. And we'll do three sets of plank hand reaches or reach outs for 20 which is 10 on each side, alternating back and forth as we do it. But good push-ups. stack your hands underneath your shoulders, up on your toes to start. If you need to modify your knees, you can. <clears throat> but we're going a good 15 reps, all the way up, all the way down, try to touch your chest and form. <coughs> when you finish your 15 reps, immediately go into plank. You shake out real quick, we'll go into plank hand reach. So we're just in a good tight body position plank here. We're trying not to let our hips dip or rotate, and we're reaching out. If you have a wall in front of you, Reach out, touch that wall, just like this, okay? Activating the shoulders, get a good burn going, and help with that corner as well. Again, that's gonna be 10 reaches on each side to make 20. When we finish those two, we're gonna go right into our main portion of the workout. You'll have four sets of flat Smith bench press and four sets of dumbbell side raises. Each of these exercises, you wanna do 12 to 15 reps, okay? If you're not hitting that 12 to 15 rep zone and struggling with the last couple, then you need to up the weight. And if you're overdoing it, don't, don't uh, hesitate to drop the weight down, please. But uh, flat bench with the Smith machine. Again, we use the Smith machine for safety purposes. If you're confident in using a free weight bar and a regular bench press, please do so. Just if you need to be spotted, be smarter about it, okay? Safety first. All right, so flat bench, coming down. Good wide grip here, or stack your wrists over your elbows for strength and uh, form. And then of course, Pressing straight through, all the way up, all the way down, full range of motion. From there, we'll take our dumbbells and either standing or seated, whatever you prefer. Today, I'll give that choice to you. You're going to go right into side raises. Chest up, shoulders are back, regardless if you're in whatever position you're in. And we're coming up out to the side, just like this. Pick a weight that allows you to bring up the weights to shoulder level. Again, remember, we're leading with the elbows to come up and down. Once we finish our four sets of each of those, we're gonna switch and we're gonna to go to an incline bar press and then we'll do dumbbell front raises. So, incline bar press, find a good bench. You can do this on, again, if you have the confidence capability to do it with free bar, please do. Know to ask for a spotter if needed. Press three, 12 to 15 reps again. And then dumbbell front raises, bringing them up in front of us ideally both at the same time, right here, okay? So core tight, chest up, shoulders are back. We're bringing them up together. Four sets of each of those, and then we move into our last series, three exercises. We're gonna end up doing a dumbbell rear delt fly, an upright row, and then shrug. You wanna do 10 reps of each of those exercises in a row, and then we'll do three rounds of those exercises. So, <clears throat> dumbbell rear delt fly, good seated position, back's flat, our chest is pointed towards the ground, and we're bringing these up, out to our sides, not up and back, up and out to our sides, so we're targeting those rear delts. Then we're gonna switch, immediately go right into upright rows. So, with the same dumbbells, chest up, shoulders are back, bring them up, leading with the elbows, just like this. Okay, if you need to switch, you can do that with one dumbbell. Uh, or if you want to prep a bar, you can use a bar to do the same thing. But then after that, we go right into shrugs. Just standing here, nice and tall, weights in your hand, come up with shrugs. So squeeze at the top, slow, low down, full drop, and then come right back up. It's really important when you do these, you keep your chin parallel to the ground. We're not looking down, we're not looking up, we're not trying to grit, we're not overdoing it here, okay? Um, nice and slow, and by the time you get to those, you're gonna feel it even if you have a lighter weight. If you wanna go with a heavier dumbbell, that's fine. Just be cautious, you don't wanna overexert your neck, possibly potentially pinch anything off. That's your chest and shoulder workout.